Yo, I feel like I ain't recorded in a minute, but you know what I'm saying? What's going on YouTube? Now I am here and I'm back with another banger video and yes, look, y'all see the title in the thumbnail? Today we are going to be starting another clothing brand, bro. I posted another video about making the brand name and all of that. So if y'all want to go see that, this is going to be like a little series. So if y'all want to go see the first beginning of the video, we picked the name. The name is going to be Agonized, you feel me? So if y'all want to go see how I picked the name and all of that in the next video, y'all go watch that, you feel me? Today, we are going to be making a design and sending it to my manufacturer. I'm, I'm probably gonna use the same manufacturer. I don't know yet. I don't know if I'm gonna find one. I might find one so I can show you guys that too. But today, I'm literally gonna be starting from fresh, feel me? I might get a new manufacturer or use my same one. I don't know. But I'm gonna be finding a manufacturer today. I'm gonna be making a design with you guys today as well, you feel me? Because you guys know I'm a graphic designer. So today's gonna be like a little calm little video. I'm gonna just be showing y'all the behind the scenes of this clothing brand. I ain't gonna lie. I'm very excited because look, this clothing brand is actually tough, but with statement, there's some stuff I can't do with statement that I'm gonna do with Agonize. So that's really why I made another clothing brand because the first clothing brand, like statement, I can't do a lot of stuff with statement because statement, I don't gonna lie, the name is, you feel me? So I'm gonna make another one called Agonize. And if y'all just wanna see the first video, go down on my channel. It's posted like, like I think last month. Yo, today is gonna be basically the part two. As y'all know. So, I know I can't do my intro because I don't got my TV, feel me? I can't do my original intro. So, we just gonna be, we just have to rap a song, feel me? I ain't gonna lie. No, 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 no. I'm gonna do it off my phone, feel me? Because we, we gotta do the intro. So, I'm gonna just put the music on my phone. Hold on. I think Lil Tyler gonna copyright me, bro. All right, so I ain't gonna cap, bro. He's in here, bro. I'm just finna show y'all. I kind of already cooked something up, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. I got my MacBook right here. I was already cooking up. I'm finna show y'all what I was cooking up. And I ain't gonna lie. I got, like, the logo done. I'm telling y'all, it is going to be fire. I'm actually gonna get this dropped as well. I hope no bugs come, bro. Because I ain't gonna lie. I hate bugs, bro. Yo, yo, Tia, 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 Tia. Here. I'm gonna show y'all this real quick. This is what I got, but I don't know if I'm liking it though, bro I don't know if I like it. You know what I'm saying? We got the little tech pack in here I'm going to be literally like to, like in this series, bro I might get a new manufacturer because I want to show y'all like bro. You could do it feel me So what I'm gonna do I'm gonna try to find manufacturers I ain't even gonna lie because I got a mock-up right here I might make another one later if I make another mock-up later I gonna see that in the video, but I want to find another manufacturer Literally with y'all, like I'm gonna go on Alibaba, I'm gonna take some manufacturers and all of that because I want y'all to know that y'all could do it, bro. Manufacturers isn't, it's not hard, but it's not easy. It's gonna be like ups and downs. You're gonna find bad ones, you're gonna find good ones. So I'm gonna find one. If you guys like the manufacturer, y'all could keep it. I ain't even gonna cap. I got my little folder for Agonize and I ain't gonna lie, I have a lot already planned for this. You feel me? Look, this is a little wallpaper, like IG post, like this is what I have for it. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. As you can see, agonized clothing right there. Yo, someone just put up with a dog, bro. They dog look tough. It's a German Shepherd, bro. Someone see someone with a camera, bro. They get shiesty. I ain't even gonna cut. I'm lying. I live in a good neighborhood. I don't know why I just said that like I live in a bad neighborhood or something. Oh, y'all wanna see the dog? I got y'all. I'm gonna show y'all the dog. Look at the dog, bro. Y'all see the dog? That dog tough. But you playing catch with them, bro. I didn't really think dogs really play catch. I thought that was just in the movies, but apparently they actually do play catch. But I never knew that. Back to what I was saying. Yeah, we got all of it here. I got the PSD, so I might change it a little bit. I don't know how I'm really liking it. Well, I'm finna show y'all. Let me hop on photop.com, bro. Because PhotoP actually be cooking up. Go to PhotoP. Literally type in PhotoP right now. Well, I gotta download the PSD and everything. I don't know which one it is. So I'ma just download both. I'm glad that guy probably don't even know that I own statement. Is that crazy to say? Bro, for everybody asking me why I ain't upload, bro, I just been chilling. I ain't gonna lie. I've been chilling, bro. I've been working on statement. I literally just been working on statement. I got new woven tags. I have new woven tags. I got more shirts on the way. So if you guys want to see those shirts, let me know. Those shirts is tough. I got mad shirts on the way. They, I think they coming tomorrow. And I got new colors for the hoodies. So I just been promoting like that crazy. And I ain't gonna lie. Since the drop, drop day crazy. 
I appreciate all you guys. If you guys are watching this video, bro, I think we're about to hit 3.5K. Hold on, let me see where we're at right now. At the time of recording, we're gonna be at 3.5K. And I know, bro, I ain't uploading like five days, bro. I ain't upload, tomorrow is gonna be the fifth day. So this is the longest I went probably without uploading uh, ever since I've been doing YouTube. So I'm just sorry, bro, my bad, bro. Everybody was asking me, yo, when you gonna upload on the Discord, bro? I ain't gonna lie, if you guys, bro, join the Discord, bro. I've been chilling, that's where I've been at, I ain't gonna lie. If you guys wanna talk, bro, me and Mad other clothing brand owners is being the Discord. The Discord is going crazy. If you guys wanna join my Discord, it's gonna be the link in the description. It is free to join if you wanna, you know what I'm saying, just the chat and stuff. But if you want all the clothing brand resources, you gotta pay for that, I ain't gonna lie. It is $10 a month, and it gets uh, edited like every day. Like I'm adding new stuff every single day. I'm gonna try to be on that, on like on top of it, bro. See, I'm literally telling y'all, bro, we be chatting in here. I'm telling y'all, y'all see this? Say what's good to the vid. So, people sending a brand in there. I ain't even gonna lie. People be asking for ops. As y'all can see, this is hard on my boy, real. But, hold on. We just got everything in here. People just chilling in here. And it is on my website. So, everybody that um, goes on my website could join in here. This is literally for everybody, bro. Not even just brand owners. People, if you order from me, go in here. If you want to ask for a little shipping update personally from me, I'm literally gonna respond. You know what I'm saying? We just be texting up in here. This is where, literally where I've been because I haven't been able to record any YouTube videos. So, what's good? Hold on. Y'all see? What's good? So, yeah, everybody goes on the Discord. It's called a Statement Clothing. As I can see. Yo, yo, what's good? What camera you use? EOS RP. EOS RP. Feel me? So, if you guys are gonna literally want to ask me any questions, bro, like, this is literally, like, my personal number. Not my personal number, but we be texting up in here. I know y'all see that. This just become, become active. So, if you guys want me to rate y'all clothing brands, just send your clothing brand, yo, rate it. People in here, other clothing brand owners as well. I know y'all see that. 400 people in here. Recently, got it 3.5K. Appreciate y'all for the love and support. I got a lot of people questioning me about the rating clothing brands. And I just want to say, bro, all those clothing brands, if I if I seemed a little harsh, bro, my bad. I was just, you know what I'm saying, stating my opinion and all of that. Y2K, K, we don't like Y2K over here. And when I say Y2K in my videos, I mean the Y2K circle logos. I'm going to show y'all because some of y'all saying, oh, I got a Y2K brand. Why am I talking about Y2K? Feel me? Hold on, I'm finna show y'all. This is what I mean by Y2K. This is like, I don't like, like this type of stuff. I don't, I don't mess with. These logos, all these, all these logos, nah, bro, L-Y2K. Y2K, K in the chat. We don't like, I don't like Y2K. So, you know what I'm saying? And any, any rate in my clothing brand, bro, if you guys wanna be in it, I'm gonna literally speak the truth, bro. I don't, like, if it's brutal, it's brutal. And I'm just finna tell y'all the truth because I'm not finna be one of these YouTubers that just chill and cap. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just show y'all. I'm gonna just speak my mind, bro. You got a problem with it? I don't know what to tell you. Y'all actually got some tough clothing brands, bro. I mess with y'all clothing brands. I'm gonna show y'all the website, bro. I got like, I'm telling you, when I first started my clothing brand, if you guys watch the other videos, when I make a new clothing brand, do it all the same night, bro. Cause I ain't gonna lie. When I started Agonize, I started this like a while ago. I ain't even gonna lie. I got the website done in like the first night and then everything at night. I ain't even gonna lie. I got the, the website at night. I, pre I think. It's not even on there. Agonizedclothing.com, yeah. Because I didn't pay to Shopify. Because I ain't gonna lie, I wasn't gonna do it. But then I was like, yo, you know what? Let me just do it. Why not? So, it's called Agonized Clothing. But it's not really nothing on there. But by the time y'all seeing this, the website's gonna be up there and everything. So, yeah, I'm just gonna buy some shirts. I'm gonna make some shirts with it too. I'm gonna get my graphic designer and I might make some as well. So I'm just telling y'all, y'all finna see this whole journey. I'm finna promote the samples when I get them. I'm finna test manufacturers. So that's why you guys really wanna watch this whole whole entire series. Next video is probably gonna be getting the samples like in hand, promoting them, showing y'all manufacturers. If the first sample is bad, I am not. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna be testing manufacturers. I'm literally gonna be like a little test dummy for y'all. Like what to do when you start in a clothing brand. And if y'all want a video on how to start a clothing brand, let me know, cause I'll make one. Let me just open Photo P right here. And if y'all don't know how to work Photo P, this is what you do. You know what I'm saying? Just go to where your files is. Hold on, I can't show y'all that. Go to where your file is, click PSD. Agonize PSD, drag it, and it's loading. And then it's just gonna do that. PSDs do work on here too. Feel me? So if you got, if you was on Photoshop, and let's say you don't got your PC or nothing on you, just go to Photo P. Put the thing on it and then we good. So this is what we got right now. I ain't even gonna lie. Let me know what y'all think of this down below. If should I have to really drop this in the fall? Let me know if I should drop this. Cause I don't know. I made this a while ago. Just on some like 
chilling. Like, I was just chilling in the Discord. But agonize, it basically means like world agonization, like something like defeating a world or something, bro. But I really just like the name. It's gonna be world agonization, and then like the hoodies are gonna all say agonize. Well, like the little A thing right here, as y'all can see. That little logo. So, yeah, this is the first mock up we got. Let me show you how, how I change the color. Nah, this is bad. I don't even got the black. Oh yeah, we was doing a cream, like we had everything set for this. We was gonna do a green one and all of that. I just gotta find it. Hold on, where's the layer? Okay, white. See, I see the green right there. We was gonna do green and everything, like. But I don't know. I don't know how I'm feeling about green. Cause green low key suck. Let me know down below if y'all like green, bro. I feel like green one of them colors, bro, that nobody likes, bro. Like honestly, I feel like green sucks. It was actually blue, not green. These are tough. I'm actually might, I might, I'm gonna actually like get these, bro. Once I get my designs, bro, like I will get a tough design, right? And I just wouldn't know what colors to do. Like the colors, picking the colors is the worst part for me. I ain't gonna lie, I hate picking the colors because first of all, the colors is like, like the make or break because the colors, bro, the colors could really make your product trash. Like if you got a good design and you, the colors suck, no sales, bro. Like, my back hurt, bro. Y'all can definitely see the resemblance with statement with the colors because I like doing these colors a lot. I can't even find a layer. All right, I found it. So we got a blue one, a black one. What I'm finna do right now, these two is right here. I ain't gonna lie. I got this colorway and these, these three. I'm debating, I might make a red one or a cream one. These are just the logos, I ain't gonna lie. This is what it's gonna look like. This one, this one, this one, I'm still debating the colors on it because I don't know which colors, bro. That's the thing. I'm always stuck on the colors, bro, because there's just so much colors to choose from. And I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm not, I don't even know. But that's the design for y'all. So yeah, what am I about to do now? I'm about to go home. I'm about to put it on my PC because I can't do all the colors uh, for my laptop because it's too slow. Stop. Yo! Now if this is broke, oh my god. Oh my I'm sorry. Bro, my bad, bro. But yeah, hold on. I'm finna go home and I'm finna show y'all. I'm gonna do the colors and then I'm gonna look for a, a manufacturer on my PC so I can share my screen with y'all so y'all can see everything. I'm telling you, I'm literally gonna get a brand new manufacturer. So if you if I get the manufacturer and I get the samples and y'all like the samples, y'all could dip, like y'all could literally just go get that manufacturer. I'm not gatekeeping nothing. You know I mean? So I ain't gonna lie, let's go home. Next clip y'all finna see, I'm finna be home. I don't know if I really like the design, bro. Let me know if y'all think I should get another design. Because I'm second guessing it. Y'all think this is tough? All the brand owners, bro. Or if you're just watching this video and you don't got a brand, let me know if this is tough. Like, let me know if y'all will cop this. I don't know. I'm really liking this. Yeah, I gotta see the different printing styles because I'm gonna, I might do uh, some distress stuff. I might make this distress. Yo! I'm gonna make it distress! Y'all just seen it here. If this blows up just because it's distressed, bro, y'all seen it here. Yo, imagine this brand actually, like, becomes up there. If this comes up there, bro, that's, got, that's gonna be so crazy. Like, a brand I started with y'all. Because I'm literally starting this with y'all, bro. With y'all. If you don't know how to start a clothing brand, just literally, just watch these videos. I'm finna teach y'all. I'm finna show y'all literally everything. If y'all take my manufacturer for this brand, I don't really care because it's not my main brand. So I'm just saying, there's gonna be like our clothing brand. If anybody see it in the bro in the future, probably in like a month or two, I ain't gonna like, give me like till December. At the end of the year, bro, y'all gonna see how far this brand has came. We basically started this together, bro. We started this together. I ain't even gonna lie. Y'all got any suggestions for the brand? Let me know. Comment down below, bro, because I ain't gonna lie, I might use them. If you got like a little tough idea, just comment down below. We, I got you. Feel me? So, just stay tuned to the video. Hit that like, must subscribe. We is at 3.5. We about to get 3.5K. Hit that like, must subscribe. I'm about to go home because I hate bugs and I gotta go on Alibaba. So, I'll catch y'all when I get home. Show the Discord link in bio. Yo, what's good with y'all, you feel me? So, it is the next day, bro, because I forgot to record yesterday. So, we are now home. And look, I'm telling y'all, I got on my PC and everything. So, that's what I'm saying. It look, it, It's better on my PC because I feel like PC is obviously faster than my MacBook. So, I could change the colors and all of that. And I'm, like, I'm about to put it to my PC screen so y'all can see it. Because I want to do, like, multiple different colors. But I want to show y'all it first. So, then we could find a manufacturer, too, as well. Because if I find my manufacturer... I'm telling y'all, I need a new one. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna put y'all on my PC in a second. So, just hold on. As I can see, you feel me, we are finally 
on the screen and i'm just saying bro if y'all know this angle bro i stream exactly from this angle so i don't know if it might look weird for the witch just chill bro but y'all can see the screen right here now, i ain't gonna cap we gotta take off all of this stuff that is on on here because i ain't gonna lie i just want to change the colors bro because i ain't gonna cap bro the colors is actually what's gonna make it make it pop so that's why i like to take my time with you know what i'm saying the colors so i gotta find it because i don't even know where i be putting this stuff the screen print i gotta take all this off i'm gonna put it back on when i uh, send it to the manufacturer. You gotta have the tech pack for the manufacturer, bro. So I'm just gonna find the other layers because I don't even know where half of the layers are, bro. I bet. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be it's supposed to be a black one and a white one. All right, so we got the white one right here. I'm gonna turn that off. And then we got the black one, the white one. Yeah, so it's gonna be these two with a little woven tag at the bottom. I might not do a woven tag just because I did that on the last piece and on my last hoodies and i do not i do not like it i'm thinking about if i should do it distress like all of this distress that will look tough i ain't even gonna lie that will look so tough if it was like distressing it so we got the black we got the white one we got the purple one right here as i can see and oh, let me just take this off the purple one we got is this a gray one mm, i don't even know yeah nah i might not do the gray we got a gray one though we got another red one nah that's not it and we got a blue one right here there's so many layers bro i got it so these is the two colors i'm not even you know what i'm saying hold on i gotta find it all right so the white and the purple so these are all the colors that i was planning on drop so it was gonna be four colors the white one the black one the purple one and the blue one i'm liking how it's coming already i might change like on the agonize on a black hoodie i might make that black for me so it's just like different colors bro it's just the colors gotta match up see look at this this is hard I, i'm liking this i'm liking this if this was like black let me know if y'all think this this making the the hoodie the hoodie bad let me know i like the gray and stuff the gray uh eh, probably not white but like a dark gray probably something like nah i'm not liking that uh i'm gonna try to make I don't know because the mm, because I see on these hoodies it's like a darker and then the white on top so I'm debating if I should just make it like a darker gray but I gotta fix this color up a little bit so y'all gotta chill I'm telling y'all yeah we gonna see we gonna literally do it we doing this brand together bro this is our brand you feel me this ain't my brand this is our brand so I'm gonna do a dark shade like a very dark one and then i'm gonna make this a little bit lighter so it could just match the theme and stuff and then i'm gonna make the text dark like the background okay hold on, i gotta change this i'm telling you this is literally all part of the process bro sometimes it gets good sometimes it gets bad i like this better i like this way better that that the black is way better like this personally i might make this white i'm debating if i should y'all think i should make this white let me know down below in the comments so i like this this hard so i'm gonna leave it like this gray so yeah i'm gonna leave it like this gray i don't know if i should leave i'm the white it's kind of looking like too plain so i might make this a little bit darker but like not too dark though because i still wanted to see it so i like that i like that let me know if y'all messing with that and then the hood it could be the hood could be dark as well it'll basically look like this that's the whole point of this bro you just gotta match the colors the colors gotta look tough so yeah, I'm like, bro, this is, yo, <laughs> this is actually tough. So yeah, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna fix up the black one and then no, I'm gonna fix up the white one basically. So I'm gonna just make it like sync up. So the black one is right here as I can see. And then I'm gonna do the same to the white one, but I don't want this video to be long. Look, this is the before and I'm gonna try to go to the after. I bet. So feel me. I found a little life hack for y'all. I ain't do the white yet, but. I found a life hack for y'all if y'all on Photoshop and I just figured this out. What you want to do if you guys have a black one and you guys want to make like the exact copy. Like let's say you guys have a black hoodie and you want to make it like the white version. Like how I'm how, how I want to do right here. Y'all going to see just copy the layer right. You want to go to this little dot down here. Click invert and then it like reverses all the colors for you. So so this is the white version. I ain't going to lie. And I'm liking it bro. White and gray. That's hard bro. So these are the four colors right here. I'm just finna like style them right here. I ain't, gonna lie. I ain't gonna do too much. Black one. I really like the black one. I gotta change this woven tag on it too. Yeah, I don't know. I might not do a woven tag. Nah, I don't think I'm gonna do a woven tag. 
L let me know, bro, because I, I don't know. Should I do a woven tag or not? It's going to cost more if I do a woven tag because I want to do it all, all of this, like, distressed. Because I feel like that will look hard. Like, all of it distressed. Like, just imagine a hoodie, right? And then the text is all distressed. Like, feel me? Like, the applique thing. Applique, I don't know how to say it, bro. The applique distress. And then the kangaroo pouch. And then it's going to be real heavyweight. I'm going to find a heavyweight manufacturer. So, yeah, I ain't going to lie. That's what I literally just, that's all I be doing. I just be, like, imagining it on. And then, like, literally, that's it. So, I'm going to drop a white one, a black one. I'm not going to do the woven tags, but I'm not going to take them all right now. So, I'm going to do all of that later. So, the purple one right here. Where's the blue one? Real quick. Purple one. And let's say for another color. So, we got purple. A nice little light purple right here. I'm going to make this a calm little. Orange do look tough. Orange look tough. But, cute little buff. Are you wearing an orange hoodie, though? I need another color. What other color shine? So, yeah, I'm thinking about just doing purple and then, like, let's say a light blue. Like a Carolina blue, i say. If you're designing, bro, I'm telling you, make sure you always organize it, bro. Because I'm not going to lie, bro. This is probably the most unorganized it's ever been, bro. Like, the top is messed up. So, the top not going to look like that. I got to change the top because it is going to be not white, but it's going to be the same color as the Agonized logo. It just makes sense. Bro, I cannot get the, the right color. We got that and then yeah. I bet. So, this is going to be, the top part is going to be embroidery and then I want the bottom to be distressed, but I'm debating if I want to do that or not. I don't really know. So, I might draw a purple in this one. I might just do three colors. The white, black, and then a brown. Brown is low-key hard to find on here. Like, trying to find a brown is hard. I could do red. What y'all thinking about this? Could do dark gray, white, black. Dark gray, white, and black. Does it look good on Photoshop or could, like, somebody actually put a fit on with this? That's what I'm going to be thinking. So, alright. So, what if I, I made the star black? Star black. If y'all saying, oh, statement hoodie, statement hoodie, I don't care. Feel me? What if I made this black, let's say, and then the back darker. I want to say not too dark, but like on some like dark, dark. Because they got to match, bro. If the whole thing about this is just matching the colors, bro. You got to get the colors to look good. I'm liking this. It's like, it's like a little dark, little calm. I'm liking this, bro. I'm liking it. And then all the A's for agonize is up here all right so i might drop just these three colors let me just go go around here and just tweak it a little bit uh no size no woven tag so this black and then change the color to this to match this so yeah now we all look matched up i'm liking this i really like this a lot let me know let me know down below if you guys think it's that l or w since i don't know about like i know the gray and the black one is going to do tough so what i'm gonna do is I'm going to get the gray and black sample first, and then if it comes out tough, I'm going to get more colors. Because that's what I did with my with my other draft as well. I dropped the other colors after. So, what I'm about to do is get the gray and black one, and then I'm not going to get the white. I'm not going to get no colors. I'm just going to get two colors, and then if that comes out good, then we're going to uh, upgrade to the black. Feel me? So, this is what I'm about to do. Take this off, get the black one. I don't really start getting the PNGs yet until I, like, I actually find a manufacturer that can actually do it. Let me take out the woven tag. And yeah, so what I'm about to do right now, I'm honestly, I'm just about to save it. And I'm about to go to manufacturers asking if they know how to, if they can make this type of hoodie. And then I'm going to get all of my PSDs and all of that good stuff right here. Make the background white. These are the first two mock-ups y'all seen. So now we're going to get straight on to sending it to a manufacturer. You feel me? So, stay tuned. You about to find a manufacturer in like three, two, one. All right, so as y'all can, yo, the camera. So, we are now on Alibaba. I ain't even gonna lie. And then we finna go. I'm gonna search up a Blick Distress. Distress Blick hoodie. Cause that's what I want, obviously. If y'all want. Cause I don't know, I don't, I'm tired of puff print, bro. Puff print is just puff print, bro. Like, everybody does puff print. I'm just tired of it. So, something like this. This this is what I meant by the distressed fiat. Yo, this is hard. I might go to this manufacturer. Should I make it a zip up? Yo, should I low key make it a zip up? Nah. I wanna do, you know, yeah, I'm liking this. So this type of manufacturer, I don't know if he is tough. So, 
I'm gonna text him. Let me see the reviews and all that. I like, I like, you know, this is the type of print. Like, will this type of print look good on this hoodie? That's the thing. Will it? I guess you have to find out. I really like this. This is, this is a good, I would cop this hoodie. Mmm, this is literally everything I'm looking for, bro. I like French tech, bro. Alright, let me contact them, bro. He got everything I'm looking for. Uh, this is literally the first one. Um, let me sign in real quick, bro. Alright, so we signed in on here. Uh, this is, I signed into my Alibaba account. So, we're gonna hit contact supplier because he got what I'm looking for. So, I'm going to say, hello. Hello. Hey, I am looking for a manufacturer that can provide and heavyweight French, heavyweight French Terry high. Bro, I want the the distressing, but I don't know what it's called. I might do 460 GSM too. I want a high GSM, French, heavyweight, high GSM French Terry cotton hoodie with custom woven tags and three a quick distress design. I'm liking that. So we finna do here, and I'm finna send him the picture, and it just signs on the hood, hood and the in the front design. So I'm finna just add the picture right here, as I see, and the agonize. It's literally just this picture. So I just took a picture of this of the mock-up. I didn't send no PNGs yet, no nothing. I'm just sending a picture so I can see it if they know how to make it at least, and then. That's when you send it. So, handler for main black by Hibway, high GSM French Terry Cotton hoodie with custom woven tags and three uplake distress designs on the hood. I'm gonna say four total designs, designs, one on the hood, on the hood, and three on the front design. Basically, that means that like this, the, the black, Let's say the agonize is gonna be distressed, the A in the back is gonna be distressed, and the A right here is gonna be distressed. So meaning that it's three different printing methods, if that makes sense. Like they gotta put epilic. I don't know how to say it, I don't care, bro. But basically, there's one in the hood and there's three designs right here that they gotta do. So three printing methods, if that makes sense. So right here on the front hoodie, can you please provide Sample cost, including shipping. Make sure you always put including shipping, bro, because sometimes, bro, they'll hit you with a sample a hundred dollars, and then they'd be like, and then after they make the sample, then they'd be like, okay, send me five hundred right now for shipping. No, bro, no. So you want to get it all of it right now. So send inquiry. That's what we got to do right here. Feel me? And then the message is sent, and then I'm gonna just go back and just. Keep, this literally this is what I'm gonna do. A flick, copied and pasted it. Remember, copy and pasted it. I'm gonna distress hoodie, custom hoodie, the stretch. I mean, I'm gonna put French Terry because I want French Terry kind. French Terry is tough. So we got that. Yo, I did not know that. Yo, that's so crazy. Like y'all literally just seen it with me. I did not know this. Why they got my hoodie? This is not my manufacturer, by the way. Yo, that's crazy. Why they got my hoodies, bro? My hoodies is not even French Terry. That's crazy. Y'all just witnessed it with me, bro. I, I did not know this. Anyways, this is not my manufacturer either. So I'm gonna go right here because this one has it too. So is he? He has one review, 15 buyers. Uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> French. I bet we finna find one. Custom no string. This batch the one year. Okay. Normalized art. I'm I'm liking this one. French Terry Crop Clover. I like to go with a manufacturer. Let's say like if you want a hoodie like this, I would say go with the manufacturer. Cause like if they know this is the type of hoodie you want then they, they know how to make it, if that makes sense. So like he put these pictures on it, I know it's probably not real manufacturer, but he knows how to make these type of hoodies and that's all that matters. Pullover patch embroidery vintage actual miss hoodie from A1 and Lee Times, 16 per. 
Okay, MLQ 50. Mm. All right, I'm gonna text bro. I'm gonna hit him with a contact, copy and paste. So I'm gonna just literally just copy and paste everything, add the attachment, agonize right here. Send in query. So I'm just gonna do this with like a, like every other manufacturer. Okay, he t she texted me, said, are the four patterns embroidered or printed? Printed, distressed, all distressed. I ain't gonna lie, I'm just gonna do this for like four more manufacturers. So I'm gonna come back in a second when the other one responds because I texted this one. So you just literally just wanna keep doing this with other with a bunch of manufacturers. And then once you start texting them, you gotta let them know what you really want, really want, let them know the details, and then that's where you're gonna buy it. Okay, so as y'all could see, you feel me, we're back on this. And I haven't sent the pictures to my manufacturer yet, but look, I'm gonna show y'all this right here. If a never pay a hundred percent for your manufacturers, bro. Always pay 50, 50. They telling me I have to for the sample I have to pay a hundred percent. I'm gonna I'm literally gonna tell them no, like no i will only pay half now half i will only pay half now and then the rest when you finish you know what i'm saying because that's just how it is you know what i'm saying if i don't like it bro because if i'm gonna pay the 100 the sample but if it's bad bro i'm not gonna pay the other rest to get shipped you know what I mean? because i don't know if they finna be bad with myself so always play 50 50 for your samples bulk price to 20 million price will be affected if the fabric quantity of bulk you know what i'm saying custom woven cost 30 dollars okay i will get custom woven as well so i'm just telling french terry i'm gonna do 400 gsm heavy weights just to let them know so i'm gonna tell them ken you do that yes or no will be a lot of orders because look if they if they don't want to do it bro just know just find another manufacturer bro it ain't that serious because if if they not gonna do it then they won't do it because I'm, I'm gonna pay 100 now 100 later because i'm not gonna pay 200 full just so they can take along with my stuff bro because you always want to pay half now half later because if you pay half now then they're gonna want that other the rest of the half so they're gonna work faster they're gonna work harder for the rest of the half so if they don't do 100 um if they don't do half and half then i'm just gonna find a new manufacturer and i don't know if the other one see the other one didn't take me back yet so what i'm gonna do is i still gotta do the pngs and all that but basically i'm just gonna go over here take off the hoodie it's really not it's really simple really think about it so copy and just I'm gonna I'm go ahead and paste it onto a new one so it doesn't like get all messy in here because I don't like it when it's all messy and stuff so these are all of the woven tags that I'm going to be using not woven tags but these are all of the tags that is going to be used the PNGs so I'm just going to copy and paste all of this and then send them the png of each of it that's really all it is bro what i'm about to do make this right here and just send all of these pngs i'm not even gonna lie so i'm gonna just take right here let's say make it a good size then what i'm literally gonna do is just take this off copy and paste it literally png hold on save it as a png make sure the background's not on there and i'm gonna say png hoodie one and then literally do the same thing for all of these each of these like make sure it's separate make sure like they're not together if that makes sense png hoodie two and then this is the third png right here this is all they need they don't need the colors and anything because they know what the color looks like by the, the hoodie mock-up you send them let me know you know what i'm saying get your supervisor you feel me because i am not paying i'm not paying 200 bro you got me beat i'm not paying 200 and then right now i'm gonna send her or them whoever it is file some local files one two three four I'm gonna send them a picture of the mock-up. Please use. Hold on. You just gotta send them everything, bro. Right here, these are what the hoodies 
should look like same colors. These are the same colors and everything. I will send. And that's basically it, bro. The other manufacturer didn't respond. So I'm going to end it off in that note. Unfortunately, it is the end of the video, bro. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. If you guys all like this video, make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe, bro. We just hit 3.5k subscribers, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? We on the road to the big 4,000. We're trying to get 10,000 by the end of the year. Everybody hit that like button, subscribe. You know what I'm just saying, bro? This clothing brand is literally our brand, bro. I texted the manufacturers. I sent the PNG, sent the everything. Now, I'm just waiting for the sample. They're making a sample right now. If you guys really like the sample, and you guys want the manufacturer you guys could go use the manufacturer if you guys want i showed y'all this in the video so this whole series i'm just gonna be showing y'all everything bro and i ain't even gonna lie i'm just gonna get up there with this brand so if you guys are new make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe well we gotta do our little mm. Miami blowing on that day. I'm a silver rapper by the track. I promise this Richie be flying on plane.